Hey guys, in this video I'll be doing a full spec comparison between the Samsung Galaxy S7 and the Samsung Galaxy S8. Now first things first, let's start off with the screen. Both screens are rocking a Super AMOLED. Now as for the size of the screen, the S7 is rocking a 5.1 inch while the S8 is rocking a 5.8 inch. A little bit bigger than the S7, that's the S8. Now, as for the screen resolution, the S7 is rocking 2560 by 1440 display resolution, while the S8 is rocking uh, 2960 by 140 display resolution and as for the aspect ratio the S7 is rocking a 16.9 aspect ratio while the S8 is rocking a 18.5 to 9 aspect ratio now let's turn our, our attention to the primary cameras the The S7 is rocking a 12 megapixel camera and the S8 is also rocking a 12 megapixel camera. There is no real change to the camera pixels so the um, Samsung kept the primary camera the same. But going back over to the front facing camera, we have a 5 megapixel on the S7 and an 8 megapixel on the S8 but um, Samsung also included the autofocus with the front facing camera on the S8 so now you can focus on your pictures when you're doing your selfies and stuff rather than just the um the face rec recognition now the chipset um they did a upgrade a bit of upgrade for the S7 it's a Snapdragon 820 or a Exynos 8990 and for the S8 is a Snapdragon A35 or an Exynos 890-95. Now, as it comes for RAM, they both remain the same with both being 4 gigabytes of RAM. However, with storage, storage, the S8 had a major upgrade having 64 gigabytes while the S7 remained and ha having a lower um, amount rather having 32 gigabytes so the storage for the S8 is larger than the storage for the S7 when it comes to the battery surprisingly The um the S the S seven's battery um is a bit bigger than the S eight battery, rocking with a uh, three thousand six hundred milli um ampere hour milli ampere hour, while the S eight is rocking a uh, 3500 milliamp per hour both are waterproof IP68 certified um, both have fingerprint scanner however with the with the S7 the fingerprint scanner is at the front while with the S8 the fingerprint scanner 
is at the back. If you can see that. Alright guys, so as for the headphone jack, both are right at the bottom of the phones. So they didn't go iPhone on us and switch to Bluetooth. And we're concerned with the primary port. As the S8 is using a USB type C, so they did a change in the charging port and the connection by USB. But for the S7, it is using a micro USB connection. Now, I remember earlier I was talking about the fingerprint scanner. So as you can see better, this is right here for the S7 and it's around the back for the S8. A bit of a weird place to put it, but you know, it takes some getting used to. That's all I have to say right now. Now in addition to the fingerprint scanner for security purposes, the S8 also has an iris scanner, while the S7 doesn't have an iris scanner. Um, but I'm not really into the iris scanning, so I won't use that. But I don't know you might, you guys might find it interesting to use as an additional security. Um, measure but I don't use it I just use a fingerprint scanner or the, um, the password now both support wireless charging um, both have a micro USB slot right here at the top okay. right, so right here Now, the, the S7 is weighing, the S7 is weighing at 152 grams, while the S8 is weighing at 155 grams it feels a bit more than the the S7 S8 that is but not by much so yeah and both are running Android 7.0 nugget um, looking for the or the update for the Oreo so I think the S8 will get it before the S7 mainly because it's a newer flagship so it should get it before the the S7 does and, and that's about it where it comes to the comparison of the two um, as for feel I prefer the the S8 feel over the S7 alright so that's that for this spec comparison video thank you for watching it and if you enjoyed the video click a like if you have a question about the phones that wasn't addressed in the video or something that was addressed in the video but you never clearly understood what I was saying you can leave it down in the comments I take criticism well <laughs> But keep it nice and clean and thank you for watching my video. Bye.